Hey YouTubers and fellow crafters, just coming to you with a, it's not completed, um, it's just a flip through and give you some ideas on how I actually created certain things in the mini. So basically to start off with, this is the front page. Um, <coughs> I don't know, I'll take the binder rings off, it might be a bit easier. Okay. And then just do the pages individually. Like I said, I'm all fingers and thumbs. I've still got sore hands, sore thumbs. Uh, yeah, that one, it was so sore and I stopped it from going right across. <laughs> um, but yeah, it was hard to, to use. It was just so swollen on the side there. So um, here we go. So where will we go? Mini, 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 mo. You're not allowed to say that anymore. <laughs> okay, this is going to be the front page. So... Um, just sort of made a bib and brace type thing. Um, the banner was off the card because I actually cut out the baby boy um, from a Project Life card. Um, I don't use them for Project Life, I use them for things like this because they're small and um, ideal for small little minis. And I think this measures about ooh, seven and a half inches by the widest part, four and a half inches, I think. Uh, right. Um, no, it's actually five inches by seven inches. There we go. Uh, centimeters is okay. Well, you Americans work in centimeters, I think. So it's thirteen centimeters by um, say nineteen centimeters. Okay, so that's just an epoxy sticker. You flip it up here. You can choose to I've got to cover that up and I'll be putting a little sticker there of some sort actually it's from the top <laughs> there we go so you can put a photo down in there and these are just some like little journaling cards or belly band I'm yet to do something at the bottom I'm not quite sure um, so they're just journaling cards Neatly in there. Uh, just journaling. And that's where the magnet is. So, so I thought it looked quite cute. It looks like little shorts, doesn't it? So, okay, and on the back, um, just some stickers. They're from Lillian um, Mystical Touch. And just a little hippo sticker that was in the stash. And, you know, in tuck spot. Or you can. Use it as a tuck spot like that. Um, put a frame in there. So, yeah. I mean, you can cut these out yourself if you want to, if you have nothing available. Um, so that's the second page. Um, third page. Now, I had a lot of these frames, and I don't know where I got them from. I think Reject Shop, when they, or the warehouse, when the warehouse was closing down. That's from some wrapping paper and I just backed it onto a bit of um, cardstock. Um, so once again you've got a little tuck spot there, tuck spot there. And it's quite cute because when the, when the ring binder's in, um, it's like he's hanging from the ring binder. <laughs> quite cute. So once again tuck spot or you can actually go from either side. Okay, here we go. Yeah, you can actually my fingers and thumbs. <coughs> How do you ladies do it? <laughs> there we go. So that's that one. Oh, that's very plain. And this one. Um, just put some corners there, some matting, photo matting, the corners in there, so you can just. Tuck your photo in there. Told you I was all fingers and thumbs. <laughs> okay. And that's just a little doing the card. And these were cut out from the Nestability dies. I don't think the brand name's Nestability, it's just a a um I got them from from eBay. 
And these are adorable. These are um, backed onto some... When I actually <coughs> cut out the onesies, I had lots of chip, you know, so... Um, that's a thin one, but that's a thick one. And you just, you know, sort of maybe cut the words out and make bigger ones. So I had actually adorable. Um, so there's one I cut out. So, and then you just um, distress the egg. Now it's funny because I've noticed a lot of ladies using shoe polish. Um, when I couldn't afford things like this, <laughs> I used to use the shoe polish, you know, because it comes also in a variety of different colours, you know, for vintage, your browns um, and some of your blues. So, um, you know, that's a handy tip too, if you've got shoe polish just to the edges. So that's how I make my embellishments, chipboard embellishments, and just go around the edges with them. Um, so, and that's cut out of um, one of the cards. So I cut the balloon out, and I've also used this as well. You know, and you can use that as well. You know, cut that out and make that little, little like a stamp. So you know, they can go in there and um, you know, so there's you know little tuck spots. And I thought this was cute. That was cut out of um, some <coughs> wrapping paper as well, and just backed it on some cardstock. Belly band uh, from a die I got. Um, I cut, I tried to see how well it would cut through um, the cardstock, you know, doubling it over. Um, and you've just got to poke it out, but it does cut all the way through. Um, this one cut clean through, so just a little magnet there. And it'll get in the spot. And I think that's um, just a journal sheet, ledger sheet from um, Bo Bunny, I think it was. Um, yeah, so I thought that one was quite cute. So I'm yet to sort of do some bit more embellishment. Okay, and this one, and th these are all just wallpaper and um, Manila folders and file folders in different colours. Um, and that's wrapping paper, and I just um, fussy cut that out. That's a button I had in my stash. Um, and these things, I actually, you know, the, the chiffon organza lace um, I got off eBay. So, and I just, um, it's not a gel pen, um, well it could be a gel pen, it's a white Mitsubishi pencil, <laughs> dot code dot limited, so I think it could be a white gel, um, very hard to get gel sets with white in them, so I just did some false stitching around it, um, another sticker from wherever, I'm not quite sure where, um, that's just ABC, that's just out from the wallpaper pack. Um, so that I'm not quite sure what to do. But um, you know you can cut your photo out or you can no, I'm not quite sure which way it goes. Does it go yeah it goes in that way, the side one. Yeah. So you can put them in. So I'm yet to finish this, I'm not quite sure. So that's the fourth one. And this is what I was saying about the um, the Okay, what can I hold put it up with? Okay. There we go. Um, so if you get your um, wood chip wood chip wood chip board. <laughs> um, you know, cut a piece long enough for that and then all you do is just edge it with your distressing stain. So, um, you know, dream big. Little man, I cut that separately. Um, you know, they were just, you know, things like that. You can cut ABC out and back it onto, or cardstock and leave it as it is. And all I did was, um, when I cut it out for the words at the top, I just edged that. And you'll see in a minute what I did. So that was basically on top, and it reached for the start. So I cut it in half, or cut it down, and just corner edged it, and reached for the stars, and then you are my sunshine. Now that I can actually cut out, or and then or just edge that 
do a decorative edge of some sort and use it again. So these are just some Project Life cards. And an elephant. And I had more fun doing the boys, funny enough. The girls were fiddly and pretty and prissy and um, but the boys sort of just came, yeah, because you're very limited, so it gives you an idea to insert that. And that card was, now these were on special at Linkcraft a while ago, so you were very special to me, so I just basically did that and fold, fold it in half. I tried to find some nappy pin stickers and I couldn't find any and there goes my battery. So um, so they just tuck in there. And the back, the little man, tuck spot, tuck spot. Uh, no. So there's a lot you can do with wallpaper and that's with wallpaper as well. That was actually a paper clip banner and I took the paper clip off and put it underneath there. So um, so there, so there you go, you know, you can make something really pretty. I love this one. <laughs> Belly band. You know, out of wallpaper and just scraps. You know, so they're yet to be finished but I love that. Cute. And there's my battery flashing. <laughs> okay, um, so if you um, have any comments um, or any questions just put it down in the comments and I'll get back to it. And uh, yeah, if you have any questions, you know, regarding how I put it together, um, I may do a mini tutorial um, and I'll fast because I'm really slow with my thumbs. So, um, you know, I'll do it like a process video for you. So, um, because I'll be making several more of these because I absolutely love them. <laughs> okay, take care for now and God bless.